Buckle up for another adventure in The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Today we are completing the John Sao Shrine in the Laneru Wetlands. Thanks a bunch for tuning in. I'm Kat and if you're a repeat offender here, welcome back to the channel. Now if you're a first timer, drop everything and smash that like and subscribe button. With all the formalities out of the way, let's kick back and get into the good stuff. This shrine is located northeast of the Wetland Stable. This bad boy is in plain sight and you can zip right over almost all the way from the Saharsa Slope Skyview Tower. With no tricks to get in, we can go right inside. This is Deep Force. The first thing you may notice is a target up ahead. There is also a buoyant yellow ball. It's lighter than water, thus it shall float. Use your ultra hand to move the yellow ball out into the water. Try to be beneath the target. Push the ball all the way down into the water and then release your ultra hand and the ball will shoot right out of the water and into the target up ahead. This opens up the gate to the next area. Within this space, a chest lies concealed in the pool, easily overlooked by the untrained eye. Activate your ultra hand to reveal its hidden presence beneath the water surface. Reach out and seize it, then bring it safely to solid ground. Crack that baby open and reveal a, a dun, 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 mighty construct bow. Stuff that in your pocket and continue along the path. Just around the corner, you'll encounter a soldier construct. Engage in battle and defeat it to clear your passage into the next area. In this chamber, you'll come across a buoyant yellow platform. It's key to reaching the target in this room. Grab the platform and position it vertically. Then, with a firm push away from you towards the target, submerge the platform deep into the water. Watch as it springs out of the water and hits the target above. This action unlocks the gate to the final area. Inside this chamber, you'll come across a vertical lift obstructed by debris at the top. To clear the way, grab the yellow ball in the room and position it under the rubble. Plunge the ball downward, smashing into the debris and freeing the lift to descend to the bottom of the water. Now, utilize your recall ability and swim over to the vertical lift. Allow it to carry you high above the barrier, then gracefully glide down to reach the innermost chamber. Before we bounce out of here, don't forget to check your map. Yep, we are 100% done. We got all one chest from this shrine. Let's clock out. Alright boys and girls, I gotta burn rubber for now, but if you vibed with the video, drop a like and smash that subscribe button. And check out my killer merch. Don't just play, slay. Until next time, keep gaming keep laughing, and keep learning. With that being said, this is KK Jinx, over and out.